Hello, it's Simon at the video of the day. Um, how do you make the Cathedral Notre Dame a place where everybody is welcomed? Alors, first you have to say that the churches in France, since a long time, um, are owned by the French Republic, by the government. In Quebec, the province of Quebec, in Canada, the churches are owned by the pa parishioners with an administration uh, committee. So, uh, it's the French uh, government that owned the building, after uh, the bishop, the Cardinal of Paris, the responsible of the cathedral. Alors, it depends on the perspective you have. Um, I believe that all human beings have the same exploitation system, like a computer, like if every computer would have Windows 10. So I believe we have the same system of exploitation for the psychology, the spirituality, the, the biology, the physical. Um, uh, so it depends on the perspective you adopt. Alors, let's pretend you arrive in front of the door of Notre Dame, puis how do you live that experience? So, uh, a Benedictine, Benedictine monk told me years ago, my director, the, the closer you get to God, uh, everything simplifies. Everything becomes uh, more simple. So, that's a criterion of discernment to know uh, 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 who's closer to God or not. So it's supposed to be very simple for um, a house of prayer, the house of God, to be welcoming to everybody. So you have a perspective like that. I believe we have the same intelligence. If you have a handicap in your intellectual, uh, uh, there's the emotional intelligence, the intelligence of the heart. So we fear the same thing, we have the same joy, we all die one day, we function um, the same, everybody. Alors, we arrive in front of the door of Notre Dame. Uh, if I'm a Muslim uh, faithful, Muslim faithful, um, they believe that God, no human being can be a God. Jewish faithful, they believe that Jesus of Nazareth was evaluated by specialists of faith, of religion, and he was evaluated like not being the Messiah. Puis many Jewish faithful believe that still today. After being the Christian, it's not because you're Catholic or Christian that it's natural to believe that somebody come back to life after being executed. On a cross. Oh, if you're Catholic, it's not natural to believe that uh, the wine or the bread is mystically transformed in the presence of God. So, I enter the cathedral. The first thing usually that people don't like to see, it's in the front over the altar, a Calvary. So, Jesus of Nazareth on a cross. Because it's a, a death penalty instrument across this. So, there's nothing going with God with that because it's a, it's an instrument of human beings that apply the law, do law enforcement. Alors, a Muslim uh, or a Jewish, the first thing they see in Notre Dame Cathedral, I think they, they, they changed it over the years, it's in front, uh, over the altar, a Calvary. In some churches, they removed it like uh, in uh, St. Denis churches that is now a public library where I was baptized in Canada. After the second thing, people realize say, they have kind of a thing with wine and bread. They think it's sick, it's crazy, mentally ill, nothing to do with God. After another thing they don't like in the church, c'est the way of the cross, the little painting representing uh, how Jesus of Nazareth was executed. Alors, um, uh, it's simple, hein? it's only that, that what people don't like. After, after the Concilium of Vatican II, in Saint Foy, there are many churches that were built at that moment, puis everything was removed, the statue. They, they don't like, another thing, statues. They say you don't worship a statue, you don't pray kneeling in front of a statue. Alors, it's simple to say what people don't like in the church. After, 
People receive their fate from their parents and their grandparents or their father. They say never betray the fate of your ancestor, of your uh, patriarch. Alors, you can be nice, you can be understanding, but never you're going to change your mind. After, uh, if you believe one thing, then automatically you believe that the other thing is dangerous. Alors, if I'm the responsible of the French government, do I remove the Calvary? Do I remove the altar? Do I, do I remove the way of the cross? Um, alors, after, là, we all have the same exploitation system. So, we feel help from spiritual uh, uh, entity. We feel threatened by some spiritual entity. But it depends the name you put on them. I think what the phenomenon of spiritual entity, uh, it's the same for everybody, but it depends on the label you put, the name, but everybody describes it the same way. Or when you pray, pure answer or not, it's the same phenomenon for everybody, but I think the prayers go uh, uh, at the same place for everybody. Alors, if I'm the French responsible, là, what do I remove, puis what do I put? After, là, if you're a government official, puis you organize a touristic attraction, it's not the same thing as a, a truth experience. But people là, in the 60s were educated that religion causes a lot of problems. But all religions talk about love. Alors, what's the problem truly? Alors, some they still have that mentality. Religions cause war. But if you have no religion, if you don't talk about it, it more, it more peace, it's more peaceful. But there's a phenomenon là, that... Uh, uh, those 60s people, baby boomers, have to uh, admit, uh, you cannot destroy everything to make a point. In the Soviet Union, they destroy all the churches, puis they, they kill people, puis work camp to make a point. The French Revolution, they destroy churches, they kill priests, puis they destroy castles they, to make a point. You cannot exclude people from a workplace because they don't think right to make a point. You cannot eliminate and destroy all ways to make a point. When you get closer to the truth, everything becomes more simple. You feel more at peace and welcoming for others. But how do you... The Muslims, they say, you never represent God. And Mohammed, that I think is a true prophet because he was promoting one God in his area. I think it's prophetic for him. Uh, you never represent God. Alors, the rosas at the front, is that an angel? Is that God? If it's God, the Muslims don't like that. If it's angels, do they like it? If you look at the mosque, how they represent the spiritual life or a dome. Alors, I enter Notre Dame. What do I remove? What do I keep? How are people are welcome? People are more immature than they think at some point. It takes a lot of human maturity, a lot of wisdom to leave the mysteries a mystery, but to leave everybody free. But the problem, là, the fate of my father, the fate of my grandfather, the fate of my ancestor, never betray that. A, a friend told me, I finished by that, if you were not been born in a Catholic province, Catholic, uh, you would be Muslim, you would be faithful. But since Medjugorje, we never had so many proof or manifestation that uh, of the spiritual world. After, do you have one universe or two universes? How many God do you have? An invisible universe, a visible universe, two gods? Uh, alors, you have to enter Notre Dame Cathedral with the perspective that we function human beings all the same way and leave what is not possible to understand an, in a mystery, puis de reste. Alors, it's not destroying everything, puis hiding a cross or a calvary that helps people to reflect and become wiser. So I don't know if you get my point. It's a question of wisdom.